Change the thermostat, now AC won't turn on. Thermostat is on, outside unit not. Also, we changed the thermostat hoping to fix an issue that when the unit is off entirely, the fan still runs intermittently. Help! I'm seven month pregnant and swelling up by the minute with no AC. Hi. I'm Joe and I will be glad to help you out. Does this system have an indoor unit or this this an all outside package unit? There is a unit of some type in the attic and an AC unit outside on ground, big square fan thing. Your problem should be in the unit in the attic. My husband changed the thermostat without turning off the power. It worked for a bit, then stopped. If you open up the service panel to the unit in the attic, you will a circuit board. There will be a small blade type fuse plugged into the board. It probably blew when the thermostat was replaced. My husband is saying he opened the panel and there is no circuit board. The brand is Carrier. Is he missing something? He said no fuses are visible. Also, the problem with the blower should be caused by this board. The fan relay is built into it and it is common to see this board go bad. My husband is saying he opened the panel and there is no circuit board. The brand is Carrier. Is he missing something? He said no fuses are visible. He should see the thermostat wires coming into the unit. If he follows them, they should go to the board. Normally located at the top side of the unit. Full size image. The fuse should look like that. He sees where the wires go in, however, they go behind another panel, with no screws, or visible way to access getting behind that panel. He says there is a cutout with a glass type cutout that you can see through, and there is a blinking light. Is this a gas unit? Yes. Okay. There should be another panel to remove so that he can see the blower. The board should be mounted to it. Okay, he is trying that now. He said he doesn't see any screws or anything to the panel, should it just pop off. There is normally two screws holding it on. Also, should he have power off while replacing the fuse to not repeat this issue? I'm ready to choke him. LOL LOL The power doesn't have to be off to replace the fuse, but he may want to cut the power off so that he doesn't accidentally zap himself. Okay. He found the fuse. Another question. We changed the thermostat to see if it would help the following issue. We just moved in, 2007 home, one thermostat, two-story home, and regardless of whether the thermostat is on or off, the fan kicks on every 20 minutes or so, and runs for about 10 minutes. By bro and law does HVAC and he had no idea. Do we have a possessed unit? It made our bill outrageous and sucks all the cool air out the AC just blew in. It runs whether the unit is on or off. It doesn't run non-stop, just intermittently. It will kick on independent of the AC. Very strange. It is normally the board, but that does sound like a thermostat issue. Was the fuse blown? Okay, so if the circuit board is the issue, what are we to do to fix the fan issue? And yes, fuse was blown. 
Also, on thermostat, does the blue wire go to C and does it need to be hooked up? Blue wire is normally C, however sometimes they get wired by different colors so the best thing is to know what it was hooked to on the old thermostat. Most thermostats that have batteries don't require C, but some do, the installation manual for the thermostat should tell you. It was hooked to C on the old thermostat, however on the new thermostat, it is battery operated and has an RC that hooks to R, and there is no C, so do we need blue wire? Don't hook up the C on that thermostat. Ops, you just answered me, sorry. Smile you have been a lifesaver by the way, thank you. Okay, so we have to go get a new purple fuse, and put that in, should that not get us up and running, aside from the demon fan issue, what else might it be, so we can troubleshoot without having to log back on. Smile. If the circuit board is causing the fan issue, then the board would need to be replaced, but being that it is so strange of a problem, I would try it with a new thermostat and see if that does it. Okay. And just so we know, is replacing the circuit board pricey and intense, or something we can do ourselves? The fuse should get you back working now. The purple is a 3 amp and you can get those at auto parts houses and most convenience stores. Would a Lowe's or Home Depot have them too? They change the board so much to where you have to do a little rewiring to replace them, I would recommend having a tech replace it. You can get the fuses at Lowe's and Home Depot also. Okay. Perfect. Thanks so much. This has been a lifesaver. Smile. If they don't have 3 amp fuses, you can get a 5 amp fuse, but no bigger than that. You are very welcome. Good to know. Thanks again. I think that will do it. Smile. Great. Have a good evening. You too. My husband said he bypassed the fuse and it's still not working. Are you still there? Is anyone still there? We have someone going to get a fuse, but in the interim, my husband bypassed the fuse, which gave the thermostat power, but AC still didn't kick on. If you have a home improvement or appliance question and want to chat with an expert now visit justanswer.com slash YTHI.